Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to show you how you can check your memory specifications available on your actual computer. And as you may well know, it goes without saying that if your computer doesn't have enough RAM, which stands for random access memory, things like your apps, games, services, processes, and all that are likely to start lagging and your performance generally will then become poor on your device. So if you are trying to upgrade or you just want to find out some specific details regarding your memory and your RAM, and just a quick video to show you how you can check the basic memory specs. Now, this isn't a deep dive, but it's just a quick look. If you just want to check quickly how much RAM you have on your system, and we're going to look at two methods in this video. Now, if you just want basic um, info um, regarding your RAM, the easiest would be is just to head to your settings on Windows 11. And I've just minimized my settings just for privacy regarding my device details. Um, head over to system in the settings page and scroll right down to the bottom where you get about and yeah you'll see installed RAM there's your total mine is eight gigabytes and you may notice though that as in, in my example it says 7.6 gigabytes usable now the, what that means is it could be that the system is sharing some of its memory with a graphics card which we'll also have a look at in the next method so that's the easiest way to find out how much RAM you have installed on your device running Windows 11. And actually that would also apply to Windows 10. Now the next method gets a little bit more complicated, but nonetheless, um, it will help you to find out some more detailed information. And for this, we're gonna head over to our task manager. And if we head in our task manager to the performance page and we click on memory, yeah, you'll see at the top, Here's your total memory, eight gigabytes. And you can also see in the fine print just under that, it says 7.8 gigabytes. So that's, as mentioned, could be, uh, be um, taken up by a graphics card that's using that additional memory. And then yeah, at the bottom, you've got some extra details. So yeah, you can see that you can actually see your current speed. You can actually see the number of slots on your system and how many are actually being used. So in my case, I've got two out of two that are being used. So basically I would have four gigs in the one and four gigs in the other. And yeah, you've got your form factor. Now something to take note about your form factor. Um, the form factor type for laptops and kind of smaller devices would be as in my case, S-O-D-I-M-M. -M, and it will just be D-I-M-M. DIMM for desktop computers, so just take note of that. And yeah, you can see hardware reserved. So that's the 243 megabytes that's um, deducted from the total eight to give it 7.8. And that's basically um, what most probably my graphics card is using on this device. So just a quick video to show you how you can just check some basic info regarding the RAM usage on your PC. And if you would be interested, I posted a video back in January of this year on how you can check your RAM capacity on Windows, which is also useful if you want to upgrade. So basically you can determine the actual capacity of RAM, the maximum capacity of RAM your system can hold. And it's a bit of a more detailed video, but I'll leave that uh, link down below and somewhere here in the end screen if you would be interested. So hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.